My ear won't shut up. Oh. Okay. Um, again, if you hear any weird noises, it's either my loud ass neighbors that never stop coughing, the cars on the street <laughs> that unfortunately I can't control, or my kitten who's now messing with the box. And this, oh, my cat is moving the tripod. Hey, get over here. This video is gonna be a mess. Hi everybody, my name is Annika. I'm a makeup artist in training. Today's video is not about makeup, it is about wigs. Learning my wig cap. Listen, I only own synthetic wigs. And today I wanted to show you guys my five wigs I own from Lush Wigs. It's a UK based wig company. They have amazing synthetic wigs. Um, and I just wanted to show you like my most worn and all of the ones that I own. So let's just start off with this one. Let me just brush through it really quick. This is called Strawberry Shortcake. Um, I'm actually on their website for two wigs, two of these ones that I'm going to show you. So this is the first one and oh my god, the hair is like all over the place. This is what the cap looks like on the inside. There, let me see, there's no clips on this one, which I don't mind. I don't, obviously I haven't glued this wig cap down and I usually don't try to do that. <laughs> That's just a lot of work. I honestly don't really know how. Um, but I really hope to one day be really good with wigs. So I'm just going to throw this on. So this, oops. I should not have worn lip gloss for this video. So this is the wig. Matches my makeup. Um, I actually, my eyeshadow is the shade Lunar Lavender from Terra Moons. I just got my first order from them and I'm definitely going to make a video on those because they are so stunning. I've already ordered more. <laughs> Alright, so anyway, I really like this one. Um, I'm somebody who, the reason I wear wigs is because of hair problems. Um, my hair, if I can find a photo of it naturally, I'll put it like right here. But I have naturally curly hair. And I used box dye on it for a long time before I found out how awful that was. And I put bleach in it. And just, you know, no good. <laughs> um, I have very damaged, breakable hair. And I was working at a Dunkin', like, closing. And I was the only one there most nights. Like, it'd just be me from, like, usually about 5 on. But I'd be there at least till 10. But I was, you know, on a headset the entire time, taking orders and stuff. And I would always have my hair pulled back. And one day I noticed that my hair had just snapped. Like, I, my hair used to be, like, down to here, past my boob even. But it would be curly, so it would be, like, right about here. And then, now it's literally, like, right here. And it's horrific. Um, I honestly, like, I don't really like to post photos of it. I think, I want to get to a good length. I might be able to do that because I it's still curly hair but it does it's not my beautiful curls that I'm used to and it sucks but luckily I already had all these wigs so yeah strawberry shortcake I love it um, it's definitely my most worn lush wig and I'm about to show you the second one okay so this is the other wig that I am on lush wigs page featured in and I'll post that link. <laughs> but this, this cat is going to kill me. All right. Opal, you need to be a good kitty. So this is bruised violet. Oh, my God. I wanted my hair to be, like, this brown to, like, purple plum ombre for so long. Sorry, I keep going out of frame. Now, this one, I really love it. I have never really had short hair, so... Something like this is just so cute. Um, this is the cap construction. Again, there are no clips. And I really don't know all the other terms. Like, I know that these can adjust the size. But, <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> I'm really not a wig expert. I just wear them because of my hair problems. So yeah, Bruce Violet, let's just throw it on. I have not worn this one in like quite a few months because a lot of my wigs have been just kind of chilling. <laughs> Alright, so I think that's kind of it. I usually just kind of push the bangs to the side. I'm like terrified to ruin this one. Okay, so here is the wig. Um, yeah, it's a kind of like an asymmetrical bob. The side is a little bit, yeah, you can see that there. I really do like this one, though, and for a while I would just kind of throw it on when I was in a rush and, didn't, you know, didn't want to worry about my hair. But I really do like it. I think it's so cute. Um, I just love the color. And... I mean, it's just a little too short for me. I am not really a short-haired person. I feel like it doesn't look on me because I have such a round face. Um, but yeah, so that was Bruce Violet. And I'm going to show you another one that kind of has a similar hairdo. So this one actually was in my closet, like underneath a ton of heavy things for over a year. And I never really got to wear it out but it is beautiful. This is called Bellini. And let's see, so the cap construction is, has this like black lace thing. This one also has um, adjusting mechanisms, but no clips and it has bangs. And let's just throw it on because I've not worn it in like literally since I first got it. Okay, I don't know if the bangs... Okay, so these are more... It looks like they're more straight across bangs. Yeah. I'm just going to brush it out a little bit. I don't want to brush it out too much. Wow. <laughs> I absolutely love the color. I think it is so cute. I mean, the bangs, like... Listen, I've never really had bangs in my life. And I am not good at cutting... Cutting the hair or anything. You will see the next wig, <laughs> how bad the bangs are. <laughs> so I tried to cut, um, cut them like one of the photos and it just didn't work. So but this is Bellini. I absolutely love this like beautiful, it's like a neon, I have hair in my mouth. It's like a neon coral almost, but a little bit darker. Bellini. This is the one, this one is crazy. I can't even believe I got this. Um. But I got some of these wigs because I love makeup, obviously, and, you know, getting these different colorful wigs had made my makeup, my, or I should say my ability to be confident in my makeup so much stronger, especially when it came to wearing, like, colorful eye looks. Because, you know, for a long time I would do either neutral browns, always, I always do shimmers pretty much any time I do makeup, so I love anything sparkly. But I would either do like neutral, glam, brown shimmer looks, or I'd do something like I'm wearing today with like just a purple type of shimmer. And I never really would do other colors. Like sometimes I'd do green because I thought it was fun, but I really wouldn't do much else. Okay, so let me just show you. This one is called Popsicle. Um, it's funny. This part matches my scrunchie. But the bangs are so bad. I mean, I literally don't know how to cut cut hair at all. That's why it's funny because around my, um, my, in my area, everyone was like, go to Empire Beauty School, which is like one of the places around here. They, on, they basically only do hair and then like a 5% makeup is what I've heard. I'm not doing that. I am not going to be responsible for ruining people's hair. So the cap construction in this one... Looks like this. And let's just see.
Whoa. <laughs> Hold on. No, it's not gonna look that great on me. Now, this this wig is really cool because, um, well, I should say Lush Wigs is really cool because when I ordered this wig and I ordered all of the wigs that I'm showing you at the same time, They're, it's the only order I've ever made from them, but I got two of these by mistake. I'm pretty sure it's because my mom had ordered these all for me from, I think it was like my birthday a few years ago. It was like two or three years ago now. I think it was two years ago. But <laughs> for some reason, they sent this one twice. And then I realized, oh, I think my mom may have messed that up. But I had sent them an email saying, oh, I actually wanted Bellini in the cart as well. I didn't want two of the popsicle wigs. They let me keep the second one and then reshipped out Bellini for free. So I thought that was amazing of them. And I really do like this company. Okay, so I guess it doesn't look like the worst right now. I mean, I try to do like the short bang thing, but I just don't know about that look on me. So, I mean, I think it's fun though. I think it'd be fun to do for like Halloween or I don't know, some kind of like fun event like a convention or <laughs> I don't know not that I go to those but I think that'd be so much fun or just for my artsy makeup that I like to do I mean it's cute I wore it on a walk one time with my husband and my dog and that was fun but yeah so I have two of these and I plan on probably donating the second one to maybe like the local drama like drama department at the high school or something I don't know okay and now this one's the last one I'll show you this is the box they all come in a box like this and this one is the longest one I have from Lush Wigs also has some colors this is called Blue Moon all right the blue is so bright I think this is another one that just kind of looks pretty damn fake but it is such a fun wig like I I don't wear wigs to be like oh I'm not wearing one like I'm not trying to go for natural usually I mean anyone who knows me knows I have naturally curly hair this is not my hair <laughs> but unfortunately while I wait for my hair to grow back we are doing this so let me just brush this one out I have never worn this one out it's the only one I've never worn out in public um, I think because I kind of forgot about it. And I also, the bangs are so heavy. Like, it's almost like a scene hairstyle. But let's just throw it on and see what happens. Okay. This one, I have to, like, kind of sit back to make sure I'm in free. Wow. Okay. You know, all I need is some black eyeliner, and I would be living my, uh, middle school emo dream right now I think I might do that I think that'd be such a fun look to do um I mean I, originally when I thought about like what makeup would I would do I thought about like a really dark smoky eye but with like a turquoisey shimmer or I don't know like a brown look with some kind of turquoise pop of color but I think this is so fun because Listen, I always envied those girls on, like, Tumblr who had the bangs like this and just the beautiful scene haircuts. I loved it. And also, there was this one guy. Let's see if I can find the picture of him. I'll put it right there. But his name was Chris Evans. He was, like, every every emo girl's, like, oh, my God. So cute. Um, I think he's a photographer. And he doesn't have that hair anymore. But he was so cute. I thought... It was so cool when guys would wear makeup like that. <laughs> but yeah, so. There's my cat messing with the box. Isn't that right, huh? Isn't that right? <laughs> um, Opal is like, she was, she was eight weeks old on December 18th, so. I don't know. I think she's like 13 weeks old at this point, maybe 14. But she is such a cutie. She is a piece of work, but alright. So this one, I guess the blue is just such like a stark contrast here, but I think it's cool how they kind of blended it up here. Um yeah. 
So those are my Lush wigs. Thank you so much for watching the video. Um, I do plan on showing off my other wigs. So at some point 